What's up guys, Shane Starnes here, and a lot of the video recording that I do is actually done on cell phones. Now the only issue with this is sometimes when I try to throw that cell phone footage into my video editor, so when I try to use it on Final Cut Pro, sometimes the MP4 files don't quite mesh, and I'll get all kinds of bugs and issues in the video. Of course, the easiest way to fix this is to convert my MP4 files into MOV files, which perfectly work with Final Cut Pro and iMovie, and the best way that I have found to do that is to process them through a Uniconverter. Uniconverter is an all-in-one tool for video processing. You can actually edit video, compress video. Uh, you can, of course, convert your video, download video. You can burn video to CDs or DVDs. So this kind of encompasses all the tools that you would need for doing anything with video. We're gonna cover everything in Uniconverter. Big shout outs to Wondershare for sponsoring this video. Let's go ahead and get started. So first up, you're gonna want to head to the link in the description. That's gonna bring you to Wondershare's download web website. You can try this for free. Go ahead and try it for free. Make sure it's going to work on your system. And then once you've given it a try, uh, the pricing on this is super reasonable. It's $55.95 for a lifetime plan or uh, just a one-year plan for $39.95. All right, so first up, we're gonna go ahead and launch Uniconverter. You can kind of see here that this is an all-in-one video tool. So you've got your video converter, which is what we're really here for, audio converter, video downloader, video compressor, editor, merger, screen recorder, DVD burner, and toolbox. So first of all, uh, we're gonna go ahead and convert some video. So we will, uh, you can either click to add the video or you can just drag and drop. So I can click on the settings here go to video and I can choose the type of video that I want this to be converted into. For this particular video, I'm gonna select MOV and you can also choose the source. Uh, you can choose the source resolution. So I've got 4K HD, 720p and 480p. Uh, we'll just do same as source and hit create. All right, and now we can simply convert. So this is going to take a few minutes here and then once it's finished converting, you will now have an MOV file, which is going to play very well uh, with iMovie and Final Cut Pro. All right, so it says that that has been a success. And here is my MOV file. So before uh, we had an MP4 file, as you can see, and now we have an MOV file. So you have the audio converter. This works the same exact way here. So you'll actually drag and drop your audio file and you can convert this into any audio form. So some formats like WAV are a little bit bigger of a file, but if you need like an MP3 file, uh, it would take up a whole lot less space. So that would be kind of why you might want to do an audio conversion. If we go over here to the downloader, you can actually download video from more than 10,000 uh, video and audio sites. So we'll go ahead and click this. You can type or paste the URL here. So wherever you wanna grab your video from, um, I'll open up, we'll go to like, we'll go to YouTube. And let's just say I wanna download my Pamu Quiet video. I'm going to go ahead and copy the link here and then I'm going to paste it and we'll download. All right, so I can download this in 720p, 1080p. I can download just the mp3. So if I need just the audio, um, I can download that here. So maybe you're trying to get some songs to play on the road. Maybe you're going to be in a spot where you don't have any internet connection or maybe you need to download some videos for offline play. Uh, you would just decide what you need here, a video or audio, or maybe you just want the thumbnail from the video and then hit download. And then that's gonna go ahead and download the video. All right, so now we have the video is downloaded. And you know, a lot of times this comes in handy for me. So if I'm covering a phone, uh, like here for instance, I downloaded the Note 20 official introduction. Sometimes if I'm covering a phone, uh, the press the press videos are really great to have for uh, just kind of giving a rundown of specs and things, but sometimes the press videos, the only place you can find them are on YouTube. So for me, this is a great place to download those press videos. So I'll go ahead and open my Pamu Quiet video. And here is the downloaded video in 720p. And today we're going to be taking a look at the Pamu Quiet. And it has always been really good at the high. The next thing we have here is a video compressor. Uh, this is just going to allow you to take, um, so like sometimes if, you, if I record in 4K, just a minute of video could be up to 10 gigabytes. So if I wanted to compress that video so that I can carry it around with me a little easier, um, I can add a 10 gigabyte file here. It's going to compress it into a much smaller form so that it doesn't take up as much space 
on my hard drive. If we go to this video editor, you can actually uh, trim, watermark, crop. Uh, you can change the audio, so if it's too loud, you can actually bring down the audio. You can add effects and subtitles to your video. So we'll go ahead and do the trim. And I'll do my Pamu Quiet video here just to kind of show you what this can do. Hey guys, Shane Stars here, and today we're gonna to be taking a look at the Pamu Quiet. All right, so you can just kind of drag and drop here, cutting out portions of the video. So this is great for like if you're recording on a cell phone and say the first 30 seconds is you're just kind of arranging the shot and then you get into the actual content, you can erase that first 30 seconds with this uh, video editor. We can actually clip, so if I wanna clip there, I can actually remove this whole segment from the video. And I'll, I'll make another clip here. We'll trim that. And then now that this is highlighted, I'll delete that segment from the video. So as you can see here, you can kind of clip and change the video. All right, so that's the video editor. If you have video that you worked really hard on, uh, you can actually put a watermark on that video so that people can find you. They know who it was that's responsible for that video. If, you know, you can actually crop a video here. So I'll show you the crop feature. You can flip and rotate the video. You can change the format of the video, 16 by nine or four by three. There's just all kinds of extra features here when it comes to this editor. This, as you can see, this is a full feature editor. We can add effects here to kind of give it more of an artistic look. We've got the screen recorder. So this is great for like if you're a video gamer and you wanna share your video gameplay or if you just need to record um, anything that you're doing on your desktop, you can use this video screen recorder. Uh, they do have a DVD burner tool. So if you need to take your video, maybe you wanna watch your YouTube videos on your DVD player, or on you know your PS5 or Xbox or whatever, um, and you don't have internet, you're able to do that with the DVD burner. And then there's an additional toolbox here for image converter, GIF maker, all kinds of extra tools here. So as you can see here, you would pay, normally you'd pay for a video editor, you'd pay for a separate video converter, you'd have to pay for a screen recording software or DVD burning software, but here you're getting everything all in one. So this is definitely a great, video tool for anyone that has to do anything on video. I will be sure to include a link in the description of where you can pick up Uniconverter today. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. Thanks guys for watching, be blessed. I will see you in the next one.